Hey, this is John Cena, WWE Superstar and 15-time champ, and you are watching this WWE Fan 13. You can't see us. Hey, what's up, guys? So I'm finally back here today with another video. I'm so sorry I have not made a video probably in about a week ever since my WWE Slam Crate unboxing video. Uh, I do have a reason for why I have not been making videos. Uh, the main reason is because I've been in a really, a really, like, great amount of pain. As you guys know, I went through cancer treatment, chemo, I had to take steroids, I had to take all that fun stuff. And I was taking that for three years straight, it kind of developed something in my knee. So long story short to explain this, in my knee, in my left knee, um, some of the nerves and some of the muscles are basically dead. So it causes a very great amount of pain in my leg. So that is why I have not been making any videos, I've been resting, and now I'm back. So I'm back today with a WWE shop unboxing for you guys. So just by the, uh, the shape of the box, you guys can probably already tell what this is. But there's two things I would like to say before I open this up. Number one, there seems to be a new WWE shop champ in the YWC. No, it is not my good friend Brandon Hodge anymore. It is me. It's quite obvious, honestly. Uh, yes, Brandon is one of my good friends, but we both know it's true. So anyways, second thing I want to say is um, I went on Twitter and I put a Twitter poll asking you guys what do you think I got from WWE Shop, like what plaque do you guys think I got? So the Twitter poll I took will come up right here and the majority of you guys said I ordered the Becky Lynch plaque. I want you guys to comment down below if A, you guys think I got the Bailey plaque, B, if you guys think I got the Becky Lynch plaque, or C, if you guys think I got the TJ Perkins Cruiserweight Championship Tournament plaque. So, I will give you a few seconds to do that. So yeah, get commenting. Alright guys, so that's all the time you guys have to comment. So, if you guys have not commented already, pause the video and leave your comment down below. So, let's get this open. I've been waiting to open this for a really long time. I've had it here for a couple months already but I barely got around to opening it now, and it's going to look very good on my wall. So, I have not opened one of these probably since, let me look at my wall, Night of Champions or WrestleMania 31, whichever one I went to first, which I think it was, I don't remember, I think I, it was one of those two, but I think it was uh, WrestleMania the last time I opened one of these. So let's get this open. I'm not opening this very well. Alright guys, so we finally got it semi-open here. So, these are harder to open than I thought. Oh, well, that would have made a lot of sense earlier. <sighs> really? And I get paid to do this. You would think I would do this a lot better. Let's see. See, um, I got it open as best as I possibly can, to be honest with you guys. Not the best work I've ever done in unboxing, but it'll have to do. So basically, uh, let's see, this was a pre-order when I got it. And it, the total came out to $71.98. So yeah, the, pla uh, the plaque was $64.99, like they always are. So hopefully I will be able to get this signed by the person during WrestleMania weekend. So let's check it out. If you guys have not already, comment down below which one you guys think I got. So let's take this out. Alright, usually with these plaques, I always have awesome luck with them. Uh, with one of my John Cena plaques, I got number 2 out of like 150. The other one I got like number 17 or number 21. I got, I have awesome numbers with these plaques. So let's hope this continues with the uh, tradition I have. So. Obviously, here's the back of it. I'm going to take the plastic off because um, I haven't even looked at it. I don't know if I should look at it now. You know what? I'm just going to wait and show you guys, and then I'll see it then, too. So, let's get my scissors. So, oh, okay. All right, so we're getting the plastic off. I really hope it's a good number because all my plaques have amazing numbers. And considering this is one of my favorite wrestlers, that probably just gave it away which plaque this is. Okay, please be a good number. 
All right, this plastic is so hard to take off. There we go. All right, so the WWE Shop plaque I got is the Becky Lynch uh, plaque. This plaque is just absolutely awesome. So let's see what number I got. I don't know if you guys saw it, but I have not seen it yet. All right, I'll take it. It's probably my highest number plaque I have, but it's still below the hundreds. So it is number 68 out of 199. So yeah, guys, let me give you a more in-depth look of this plaque. All right, guys, so a closer look at this plaque. At the top, you guys can see that it has a picture of Becky Lynch uh, holding up the WWE SmackDown Live Women's Championship. Uh, as you guys know, Becky Lynch won this at Backlash 2016, and she became the very first uh, WWE SmackDown Live Women's Champion. Now getting closer to the bottom of the plaque, you guys see it says uh, Becky Lynch becomes the inaugural WWE SmackDown Women's Champ, uh, September 11th, 2016 in Richmond, Virginia. At a very young age, Becky Lynch dreamed about becoming a champion in WWE. Fast forward to 2016, and the last kicker has climbed to the top of the SmackDown Live Women's Division by outlasting Alexa Bliss, Naomi, Nikki Bella, Natalia, and Carmella in a six-pack challenge, matched to become the inaugural Women's Champion. In the final moments of the bout, Becky Lynch tapped Carmella in the disarmor submission to claim victory in a performance that can only be described by her fans as straight fire. And then to the right, you guys can see it says what number plaque I got. So it has a piece of the ring mat from Backlash. And you see I got limited edition number 68 out of 199. All right, guys. So I hope you guys enjoyed this short unboxing of my new WWE Becky Lynch plaque. I know it's kind of hard to see with the with the lights, but that's why I did a more in-depth look of the uh, plaque. So yeah, guys, um, I really like this plaque a lot. Main reason is you guys know I'm a huge Becky Lynch fan. Um, I actually talk to Becky Lynch a lot on Instagram, which is kind of hard to believe. I know, just go on my Instagram and I have pictures shown, but every time I message Becky, she always responds back. She's an awesome person and I support her 100%. And to be honest, she is the best female wrestler along with Sasha Banks on in WWE. So yeah, I'm very happy to have this. Can't wait for it to go on my wall next to my Cena plaques. Before I end this video, I just want to say a couple things. Thank you guys for uh, getting me to 24,000 subscribers. That is crazy. Last time I checked, I had like 24,003 subscribers. That is more than I just ever thought. And just I just want to say thank you. All right, guys. And I also wanted to say that if you guys have not already, go order WWE Slam Crate. Um, if you guys watched my unboxing from WWE Slam Crate, you saw how awesome all the stuff was. And if you guys are interested in getting it, click the link down below that says WWE Slam Crate. And at checkout, use MWF13 and you guys will get 10% off your order. And last thing I want to say is to my good friend Brandon Hodge. Uh, Brandon, you need to be sending over your WWE Shop Championship to me. So uh, remember to send it to P.O. Box 13169, El Paso, Texas 79912 because obviously we know who the new WWE shop champ is. So yeah guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will see you guys tomorrow. All right guys, so I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Make sure you give that like button a thumbs up, comment down below, and subscribe for my future videos. And thank you for watching, you can't see me.